Welcome back everybody, I'm Silly Surfer, and I'm coming back at you guys today with a how-to video on how to make Darth Sidious slash Emperor Palpatine slash what, Sheev Palpatine slash the Emperor from Star Wars in the LEGO DC Super Villains Customizer. So let's get started and we're gonna go ahead and pop right off with a preset head. We're using Simon's head or Simon if you will. And then you're gonna wanna make it the color on the bottom right corner right there as shown on the screen. I don't know what color that is. Um, moving on, let's go ahead and go down to the arms. And we're gonna make these black, plain and simple. Black, just black. Like so, nothing, no any, no, no decals or anything. Uh, moving on to the hood, we're gonna make it up, we're gonna pick a hood and make it black. That, can be found in the helmet section. For the body, we're gonna use a preset body, League of Shadows Ninja, and you don't have to change anything about that one. It's already the way it should be. Uh, hands, just black again, like the arms and the hood. Um, the hip is also gonna be black. He wears a lot of black. The legs, you could do just black if you wanted to, but I went with Captain Boomerangs just because I thought that looked cooler but it's completely up to you. Um, and then the cape, we're gonna go with cape number nine and make it black on both sides. Cool. For the personality, uh, simple speed, and then live wires targeting system for that electricity. Um, and then his health color, I made it black because it looks cooler. And then he has standard health type. Um, now for the abilities. Nothing for Y, nothing for X at all. Uh, nothing for tapping B. Actually, never mind. For tapping B, we're doing um, uh, detective mode, which is, in my defense, like force usage. And then holding B, we're doing a beam of lightning. And we're gonna make it that color of blue. And then using style number five for the lightning effect, like so. Doesn't that look sweet? And then damage type, electric, obviously. Um, and then the origin is going to be from the two hands, but whatever. Um, now for A, no hyper jump, no hyper jump. And then double jump. We, we allow the double jump because he is force sensitive. Okay. Now for the skills, he is acrobatic. He is mind control. He can use telekinesis with the force and he can beam deflect and he can track using the force. And then you can make that red, you can make it blue, whatever you want. I don't know. Red seems more like the Sith color to me, though. Whew. Okay. Um, go ahead and name your character. I went with Darth Sidious. You'd go with the Emperor or Palpatine, whatever you want, really. Uh, because he has a lot of different names, guys. Sheev, too. Um, now, if you wanted to add a lightsaber, you could go to the swords sections over here and, um, and make the rapier red. Um... But I did not do this because, personally, I don't like the way it looks. Like, it's close to looking like a lightsaber, but not close enough in my book. So, that's completely up to you, though. Uh, here's, the, this, here's how to do that, in case you want to. And I'm going to go ahead and do a quick character showcase for you. So, here we have the Emperor and his lightning. Nice. And then the background right there we got, we're electrocuting the Grand Inquisitor. He's a failure. Sorry, that was supposed to be an impression of the Emperor, but uh, I can't do that. I can't do the impression. I can't do the impression, so. Um, so anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, leave a like, subscribe, comment, any people you want me to make in the customizer. And also, um, if you haven't already, check out my um, video. It's a five-in-one, like a review, analysis, summary of um, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. Um, and that's going to be great because Obi-Wan just came out and also the trailer for... Um, Last Survivor, Last Jedi Survivor, or whatever it came out too. So go check that out. Stay silly. Boom, diggity, boom, diggity, boom, boom, boom.